What's happening? After yesterday's video with Zatu and Mewtwo, I was thinking there's one of my favorite Pokemon, Espathra, that can pretty much do the same thing with an awesome ability. So let's go to the deck list. Espathra EX has the ability where in order for your opponent to attack, they need to attach an extra energy. Now with cards like Sparkling Crystal, where your opponent can use to subtract an energy so they can try to attack a turn earlier, you're actually negating that. So they have to use another turn in order to attack. And because Espathra EX is a Terra Pokemon, uh, the new stadium I put in here is the area zero. So now we play a four, four line of Zatu Nod to trying to get through our deck add as much energy to a sponsor as possible we'll play a couple switches because a zatu only attaches to your bench we got a pheasant dippity in case we get knocked out and for the a spec because we want to get all our stage one out we're playing the hyper aroma we got 11 energy two vessels to make sure we can try to get set up so I've done this video before, but not in Stellar Crown with this new Area Zero and putting all our Zatus down and basically can get eight cards if you have the four energy, plus adding energy, which increases the damage on a Spothra. Now the decks that worry about energy, we can pretty much have a good matchup. The Oko decks, little tougher. So let's hit the ladder, see who we hit and see it in action. Oh, what are we going against here? Moltres and Charmander. Okay, got it. Now, the good thing is, love going against Charizard with a Spothra. Uh, the bad thing is, uh, I guess I'm going to have to use my Arvin to get some stuff down, but I really want to use it for uh, the Hyper Aroma. So let's see what we get top deck here. Uh, let's see. Come on. Can we get... Oh, that's a great top deck because now I get to do this, this, perfect. We're going to also go get down another uh, Zatu. Cool. So I have two Zatu, two Flittle. I will put this there. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to go on a li I'm not going to do it. Nope. Not going to do it because if I do it, they'll Iono and we don't want that. So here's a good thing. I can get my Hyper Roma, get three of these four uh, good to go. And uh, the question is, do I take the chance? Well, I guess no. If they come and knock me out here, then I just come up, do the attachment, and that's the end of that. If not, all right, let's see what they do. Because if I do the attachment, actually, I won't knock, I won't be able to knock them out. So let's see what they do. Do they go with a uh, discard two energy from this Pokemon that does 120 damage to one of your bench? Oh, yeah, they're going to do that all day. Oh, I can't believe they didn't. Or maybe they didn't want to discard, but they could have taken out uh, a whole bunch of stuff here. Both flittles. Burning darkness for 360. All right, so now what do I, I get? I get Hyper Aroma. And then I, I, I think I just... Oh, uh, do I take the chance? I'm going to take the chance. I'm going to do it. Why not? We're going to take the chance. All right. Here's also why we get to take the chance, because now we have Pheasantipity ready to go. All right. And now, boom. Go get Hyper Aroma plus the Rigiband. Nice. Go get these. Natu, Natu, and Aspothra. Put the Natu there, and we're going to get a whole bunch of cards here. Put the Na uh, Zatu there. Uh, I want a couple energy here. Is there anything else I want to do? Not yet. Let's Clairvoyant Sense. I need another energy. Come on. I need a couple. Oh, the switch works too. All right, so we're going to put this, and since I got the switch, come on, give me an energy. Come on. Come on. Uh, all right, so I got a Flittle. Mm, I don't have a way to get an energy, which kind of stinks because now I'm short on hitting out the Charizard. Yeah, there's nothing for me to do. Uh, switch. Now, the good thing is I'm going to knock it out on the next one. There's nothing I can really do. Um, I could get, could do this, could get the energy retrieval. All right, so let's, let's do this. Let's go get 
another Zatu because I have a or not to because I have a Zatu available. We're gonna hope and we're, we're just short the one energy. Now, unless they attach an energy, they can't attack anyway. Really unfortunate. All right, let's see what they do. Arvin. Arvin's gonna get them. Um, uh, I don't know. They don't, they don't play Vessel. We know, kind of know that because they kind of, uh, they do the self charge here. Uh, I am always, I'm going to have three Zatu down. Uh, unfortunately, no energy. I play that much energy and Pheasant Dippity didn't find me an energy or a Vessel. But if they don't find an energy, I just get a free knockout here. Do they have an energy in hand? They probably only play five, maybe six right now, right? So, doesn't look like they're going to have it. So, me missing an energy, not so bad. And, oh, they do have it. What took so long? If you had it, just play it down. Were they thinking about not doing it? Yeah, you're only hitting for 150 because I haven't taken a prize card. And I got the rigid band. All right, and we're going to do this. We are going to do this. All right, we, we are fully ready to go. We're going to now hit for 360. Which is way too much. But unfortunately, that's just the way it goes. We are now taking two prizes. And I need some energy. What? I need energy. I need energy because I don't want to get knocked out. All right. Evolution. Radiant Charizard. All right. Radiant Charizard can actually hit me out. Uh, but it's going to need extra energy. Why they put there? They're going to evolution. They should have put it on Radiant Charizard. Because now they just made it easy for me to knock them out. Well, actually, I had it anyway. Ooh. Oh, I want that boss. Oh, give me the boss. Give me the boss. Give me the boss for Pidgey. Come on, buddy, buddy. Nothing. All right, then uh, we'll, just, we'll just hit this and take a prize card. All right. I'll take it, though. Oh, I need an energy. Gosh darn. I need an energy. I need an energy bad. Now, if I do get knocked out here, I do get Pheasantipity. That should find the energies. I put up a Zatu, and yeah, they're just going to concede because they, they know that the weakness is it's a killer. All right, what are we going against here? Minchino. Oh, this is this is not a good matchup here. Lugia? All right, we'll, we'll, we'll try it. All right, so we got these two going. We know that they're not going to... Uh, attack but what we're gonna do is go get another not to because i want to get as many as i can in case i get all right so here we go all right so we are going to be able to judge uh i'm going to get i don't really need the team star grunt in this matchup they got the gift they're going to do luminous sign so probably either Carmine or uh, research. Let's see what they got. Probably research. Um, and then if I hit them out, the gift actually doesn't matter. And if I don't hit them out, the good thing is they can't one shot me. They're gonna Iono, which actually I'm uh, I'm really okay with because I got squat. I was gonna have to judge anyway. All right, so here we go. Come on, some energies and a spot there and an Arvin. Yes. Oh, this is perfect. All right, so we're hitting out the Minchino. That is a definite, which is good because that's the only one that can one-shot us. And we're going to get some energies down. We're going to get at least two energies down. because, And if I find a switch, it'll actually be three energies. Uh, and then I can do some damage to everything else. All right. Now, I am going to give him Gift, which is really only two extra cards. All right, so there we go. We got that. Uh, we are going to Arvin for, where's Hyper Roma? There it is, with the Ridge Band. Got it. And now we're going to go get Hyper Roma for Zatu, Zatu, Zatu. Oh, yeah, we want all three. Boom. Okay. Now we're going to Nest Ball because we're, we actually, we might not get knocked out. I need another Flittle just in case. Okay, Zatu. Here we go, Zatu. And the last Zatu. We just need to save one energy so we can attach unless we find a switch. And we are going to get the knockout here. It is only one, but it is the only one that can knock us out. So that is the most important thing. 
All right. And boom. And do we get a switch? Do we get a switch? No. Uh, but we do get the ridge band. And here's the thing. Let's let's get rid of the one energy is okay because I do get two. So now I can do another Zatu and still get, let's see, do we want three? Yeah, we'll put three because I think that should be enough. We're going to put one here and now we are going to retreat. We're going to come on up. Is there anything I can get rid of? Nope. And we're going to take the knockout at 150. Now, if they hit me, they can't hit 290 anymore. So they did get two extra cards, but they can't hit 290 as it stands right now. And I just boss. I think I just boss. Oh, they could boss and take out a Zatu. All right, Luga V-Star. Do they have any? Uh... Oh, they don't, even, they don't even have Archeops in there yet. A nest ball for what? Nest ball for Minchino? Is my guess. All right, what are you going to nest ball for? It's taking forever. They're going to nest ball for Ursaluna, which is not going to do anything yet. We still have. They're going to ultra ball. They still have no. All right, there, uh, there's no way they do one Archeops because I would boss that thing up in two seconds. They're going to do another Luminion. Now, they have to two-shot me. So, as long as I can get the knockout with this three energy, I can start loading up the second Aspothra. Okay. Luminous Sign. I don't think they play another Iono. Because I kind of... I am really set up really nice. And they're going to get a boss. Okay, but are they going to... They're going to do it with one Archeops. No way. Okay. They are going to only do it with one Arky up, so they have to attach, plus a double... T yeah, they can actually knock anything out they want. But the fact that they only were able to get one Arky ups down is uh, really key. Because I have to take out a Zatu now for two prizes. All right, Legacy and that, and they, gotta, they have to attach for turn. Missed. Okay. Boss. Yep. They're going to take out that Zatu. That's fine. But I'm going to be able to get... Um, there's no way they can do it again. Because I'm actually going to hit out the Legacy. And unless they play a Roseanne's backup, they're either going to take one prize. Because I am not going to put down Pheasantipity. There's no way. All right. So we're going to put that down. We are then going to... Let me make sure I have the energy. It's 240. So yeah, I'm good. I've got the damage output. So we're going to start putting uh, energy on this one. Boom. And there we're going to do it again. And like I said, I'm not going to put down Pheasantipity because I kind of have everything I need. But I am going to put down a Zatu. Oh, there's Pheasantipity. I don't, I, I don't want to. I don't want to give them an easy uh, two-prizer boss. All right. So let's uh, Super Rod. So we're going to Super Rod these two plus an energy back in. Okay, now I don't want to boss. Let's Arvin for Buddy Buddy because now I can go get that Zatu down. Zatu, boom, or Natu. I always mix them up. And we got one, two, and we'll go ahead and get this. They, we don't need Arvin. I don't need a switch. I don't really need anything else. I've, I've got a good hand. I'm taking only one prize this time. But they can only take one prize themselves. And there's a, the Zatu. That's perfect. Uh, what I don't have is any energy. So I need a way to get the energy here. Uh, I got a uh, vessel's gone. There's one energy there. All right. So I got a couple options here with either Night Stretcher, a vessel, or an energy itself. Or an Arvin to get me the vessel. So I'm looking pretty good. They're going to come up with Ursa Luna. They would need at least three. They would need four energy. And that's not even going to do anything. Because four energy is, is even if you get it and they're not even double turbos, which is impossible. You hit for 240. You're only hitting for 210. And it's going to be less than that. And, yep, there's the, they, they can't do it unless it's a double turbo. Yeah, you can't because the spother makes you take an extra one. I've only taken two prizes. All you're going to do is probably concede now. Because you can't even 
take the knockout. Uh, can I? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, I'm going to need actually two energy. So unless I get two more energy on this one on the bench, there's really nothing I can do. So I would, I would need energy or I just hit the Ursaluna for what I can. One, two, three, four. Or the other option is I just boss up their Archeops. And that's pretty much the end of the game. Oh yeah, now I just boss up their Archeops. Because the Arche I'm going to hit for 150 anyway. Now, you all right, we're going to get a nice concede. Uh, let's put that down. Let's put this down. Let's, uh, we can get rid of this. I can do an attachment for energy. I really don't need to because this is probably going to end it. Let's see. We'll boss first, making sure we can hit the 150. Nope, it's only 120. So now we will add that. We will then put some energy here for three. We can night stretcher so we can put some more energy on the other one. Why not? And I can Iono, I can switch, or I can night stretcher for one more energy. Why not? Because I have another Zatu. And we'll put it on the other one. Nah, we'll put it on this one. So we'll go 4-4. Four, four. Here we go. Arvin switch, Ultra Ball. I don't need anything. Uh, hit this for 150. They can only attach from hand. That's pretty much game. Uh, the only thing they can do is... Let's see, I've taken three... So they can't literally cannot attack with anybody. There is absolutely nothing they can do. I have two switches available. Still was not able to find uh, area zero to get even more down. Yeah, Louis is a tough matchup for this, but we got set up fast. And they only had one Archeops. So I think they just left. I think it's safe to say they just left. Next time... Hit the concede button. All right, they're coming up with Luminion. I'm sure the computer did that. We're going to have to wait it out. So I'll stop talking. Oh, they just turned it over to my turn. I need an energy. Let's uh, let's judge because I just want an energy so I can knock this out and be done with this. Didn't find it. All right, so we'll just hit for 150. No big deal. Normally I would have researched, but I was trying to knock this out. So we can get on with the game. And Espothra gets the other win because they took too long because they left. Okay, we're going against Dragapult. Uh, what I really need, let's see. We really need if we're going against Dragapult. Uh, let's get another not too down. We're going to put that down. Uh, I'm not going to do anything else. Uh, here's the problem. Uh, all our guys have 50. So I need something. I need an Arvin, a Roma, even a Zatu at this point to get me a couple more cards. Are you serious? They've got nothing? All right, buddy, buddy, for uh, one of each again. Here we go. And the funny part about this is uh, I can just attach and I can hit for 10. Yes. Let's see what they do. They don't have anything either, do they? Because if they didn't have it before, unless that top deck's an Arvin, we're both struggling here. They can dust clops and actually take me out, but then I win. <laughs> nope, nope, they could actually take me out here. That's that's uh, truly funny. They're going to get their Dreepy. Okay. Are they going to dust clops me out? No, they they thought better of it. Would have been funny. Uh, there's a Zatu, so that's good because now I'm going to get a couple extra cards. I'm also going to Clairvoyant Sense onto the other Flittle. And we're not going uh, to... Do, 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 do. We'll put down one area zero. And unfortunately, I'm going to judge. Because... I need, I need, I need an Espothra, because if I get an Espothra, which we do. All right, we got an Espothra. We got another Natu down. Boom. Uh, I'm hitting for 90, so I'm not going to do anything else. Because now I hit out their Dusclops, and I, I, I can uh, use that other energy to draw. 
which is what I need. Now, if they need three energy, so they either need, uh, yeah, they okay, they don't have it, good. All right, so we're just going to keep uh, taking the knockouts here. Uh, we're going to uh, use Zatu, and maybe we get some other energy of some sort, because I really want to add more energy up there. Nope. Flittle, flittle. We'll put down another flittle. Why not? I, I, I don't need anything else. So we'll hit this thing for 120. Now remember, they, they are... Uh, they definitely need... All right, come on. Give me an energy. Arvin, Vessel, something. Judge? All right. I mean, Judge isn't really going to help me either much. And they're going to Arvin... So they would absolutely, or they can just headbutt for 70 if they find the crystal. Well, they, they will find the crystal. So they can rare candy, find the crystal, but then they can only headbutt. And they don't even have that. Yeah, we're, uh, should we judge them out of that? Uh, no. What we're going to do is get this. We are going to get some energy. We're going to try to find some other things here. We're going to Zatu onto this one. Uh, this is just a, a great, um, let's get Pheasantipity out so they can get that. We are hitting that out. So we're, we're going to, we're just going to keep going and loading up this one. Uh, now we can actually put the rigid band down. Flittle, flittle, flittle. I got three flittles. So let's go and get another vessel. Let's just get another vessel. Get rid of this. Get rid of that. Go get two more. So I can start adding energy. <laughs> two everywhere. Uh, we'll put an energy there. We can actually... Do I want to judge or just get... Nah, let's just leave it. 150. Taking another knockout. And we know they have the crystal. But the worst they can do is... And there's another energy, so I can add more to these flittles. And then also hopefully find another Espathra. And there's the concession. Yes! <laughs> oh, Radiant Greeter, that's not good. But most likely they can't do it on the first try. I did get an Arvin, so we're going to get a flittle and a Natu. And I'm actually going to put this down there. And do I, no, I'm going to save the energies because I can use it. Okay. Yeah. We're, we're going to save the energy because I can use it to get on the flittles. Well, it's going to be an Espathra. So I'm going to find my Hyperoma. Uh, and then do two Zatus. And hopefully out of those cards, after I take everything out, uh, I'll be good to go. Ooh, Irida. What is this? Palkia. All right. Palkia we can handle. Chen Pao is the one we don't really want to tote to dial. All right, so now they're going to get uh, probably a tote to dial. Oh, that's awesome. Earthen Vessel. Okay. So we definitely have to get down Manaphy ASAP. Although, actually, all these are going to be um, evolved. So we're good to go. And then the next time I find a buddy buddy, I just get down Manaphy and something else. Okay. Or just put down Manaphy now. That uh, that kind of works out really well. Uh, Hyper Aroma. There you are. It is there. We're going to get down three more cards. With a Spothra and two Zatus. We are going to at least put one Zatu down. All right, we're going to use, we're going to get at least two cards here. We're going to Clairvoyant Sense, see what we have. A switch, a switch. Nope, another energy that actually also helps because now I can get down this. Maybe now find a switch so then I can attach here and actually do some damage. All right, so we'll get another Flittle. We will get, uh, I'm going to get two more energies out because I do have, again, thinning the deck is the key here. So we're going to put this, we are going to retreat and I am going to have 
two energies to go get. I'm not going to do it yet. All right, we only hit for 90, but here's the key. We got Manaphy down, and we got a Spothra in the active. So they're going to need an extra energy if they want to attack. Which, the V-Star can take care of that. However, they can only use the V-Star once. And they're, they do have the three energy in there. We have not knocked anything out, so they got rid of their counter catcher. All right, so Greninja, well, Greninja's not actually going to work anyway. And if they use their V-Star, they still need one in hand. Unless they have a switch. Okay, that's the one in hand. Then they can, they can V-Star. Oh, they're going to Iono. It's just exactly why I did not use the Energy Retrieval, because now it's at least still in the deck. And they got up a barrel... Uh, we got a Natu down here. We're going to get a Natu. We're going to get another Spothra. We've got to keep these low HP Pokemon uh, good to go. Uh, the other good thing is we have an Arvin, which now can get us a Vessel. As long as I haven't used both, I have not. And they are going to switch probably to Palkia. But Palkia does at most 260 unless they find... Well, they don't have a Terra. I mean, actually, for, they can do at most 240. Because they can star portal. They got to put all three down. And they do. All right, so they're going to do uh, 220. Nope, 240, but it's only going to be 210. Yes. All right. And the good thing is now I can attach some energy there. And I got area zero. So I do want to get area zero down because I have a Terra. They don't. We're going to go get this down. Boom. We are going to go get this down. All right, we got everybody down now. Okay, we have thinned the deck. Now the question is, I would have to get rid of my pal pad. What am I hitting for? Only 180. So I would want to get energy retrieval. Because then I don't have to get rid of my pal pad. All right, so energy retrieval. And I can use the pal pad for maybe the boss or something. And let's clairvoyant sense. Because we're going to need... We're actually going to two-shot this. They're going to hit me out. Which is actually okay. Unless I find a switch off this one. Then I can delay it a little bit. And... Got to judge a spot through it. Okay. So I'm hitting for 180. 210 is not going to make a that big of a difference. So we'll just take the... We'll give it to them. They'll get the first knockout. But we're, we're going to hope Espothra's ability causes havoc because they can't use their V-Star again. So they're going to... Oh, they get, that's how they're going to get it. They're going to get EXP share. All right. They got Irida, but if they don't use it... They got the rare candy. Into... If they don't use it... Nope. Cro, Croconaw? Croconaw, I'm not sure what that is, but I'm sure we'll find... Actually, it's going to be a Ferragulator. Okay. Did not know that. Have not seen a Ferragulator since the last format. And they are adding energy there. They're going to subspace. Well, yes, they are going to hit for 290. I helped them out. But they're not going to be able to do it again. I'm going to actually hit them out now. I'm going to put another Espothra down. All right, so we'll put another Espothra down. We are going to Clairvoyant Sense onto that Espothra. Boom. Let's see what we get here. We do have a switch. So we're going to Clairvoyant Sense again onto this Espothra. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to Judge. Boss. No, I want to hit this out because this is the one that's going to do the most damage. Uh, we are going to... Do I star grunt to put? No, that's going to give him another one. All right, so because we want it in the discard. I'm going to judge them because I have enough to knock them out anyway. And I found a, another Zatu, so that goes down. And now I can get flip the script, getting more cards, which is hopefully going to give me some more energy, which it does. So we are going to even get more energy. Oh, this is fantastic. This is absolutely fantastic. We have, and I think we get to Clairvoyant Sense one more time. Yes, we do. Clairvoyant Sense onto here. And another Zatu. Uh, we're going to Clairvoyant Sense one more time. This is fantastic. 
all these clairvoyant sense loading this guy up because we can always retreat if we need to if we don't find a switch and uh that's that's about all we need so 180 knocking that out and now they're gonna need to find more energy all right so they got that one down i've got two all right night stretcher and a flittle our Feragulator is once during your turn, you may put up to five damage counted on this Pokemon. If you do, it is used, does 120 more damage. It actually knocks me out. No way. Yeah, but they're going to need to keep an... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. We actually might lose this one. Because I have a barrel. That EXP share, is, that, that, that was a bummer. The EXP share was a real bummer. Because now they're going to just do, yeah, an attack and attack. Boom. They're going to Iona. It doesn't matter. I, there's nothing I can do. The only thing I can do is if they do, this doesn't even hit for 130. It only hits for 80. Bossing's not going to do anything. Now they're going to put 50 damage, and now they're going to hit me for 280, which here is where I needed. Oh, wow. Yeah, that, that's where I needed the Rigiband. There is nothing for me to do. Um, yeah, we, we just plain old lost. Because cause Feragulator hits for 280. Yeah, there is nothing for me to do. We, we, we're just going to flip the script. And yeah, I don't think there's anything. I can just, I can hit this out. Yeah, 240. But they're just going to come and do it again. Because they have the EXP share. All right. I mean, it, it kind of a, a, a weirder deck, obviously, and uh, they got me. They got me with the EXP share. Who knew? I mean, other than that, I was set up pretty nicely. But uh, yeah, we can't. We cannot compete with that EXP share, giving keeping their energy on the board. All right. I mean, you can't win them all. Are they gonna make me get rid of my? Uh, Pokemon? Hopefully not. Yeah, okay. Alright, so today we went 3 out of 4. Even beating a Lugia who can actually one-shot us with the Chinchino. Fortunately, they weren't able to get it set up. Unfortunately, the game we lost was because of EXP share, which is an energy saver, which is literally going against our ability. Now, I haven't ran into a Feragulator in forever, but of course, when I play a Spothra, I run into one that can one-shot me that plays EXP share. Quite hilarious. Let me know what you think about this deck in the comments below, and I'll see you next time.